Hi guys, it's Sydney. Welcome, welcome back to my channel. So by the time you guys can tell that today I'm going to be doing a MacBook unboxing video. It's finally here. I hit that a little bit too aggressively. <laughs> but I decided I would purchase a new laptop because mine is literally done for. Like, it's so slow. I was trying to hold off from buying one because MacBooks are not cheap products. And I can't just, like, go buy them whenever I want to. Like, I have to really think about it. Spend time saving. Like, make sure this is what's right for me to do right now. And my laptop is way too slow. I had it since 2012. I'm going to show you because I kind of want to do, like, a little bit of... A comparison that's not the point of this video but i do kind of want to show you but i have this macbook pro 13 inch retina display this is the one that i use you can see some dents on here all of the little things on the bottom <laughs> are gone um this is a 2012 uh, so it's been around for a few everything else is you know fine with the laptop it's pretty functional the only thing is it doesn't work properly without being charged like if i was to get on this now and play it would probably only last a good five minutes before it turns off so it has a battery issue and it's just it's a bunch of issues with this i decided to order the macbook pro 16 inch because i wanted to upgrade i kind of wanted to feel like something different obviously anything that i would have gotten would have been different from that like anything would have been an upgrade from that 2012 laptop i'm telling you this now but i don't know my mom convinced me to get the 16 inch i was like okay i'm just gonna get 13 inch but then it was like you know, I edit on my laptop and be in school. So I'm like, I need to just have something that's not going to die on me. Like, so without further ado, I actually just want to go ahead and open it. I also have some tech accessories that I want to unbox for you guys to and try out that I got from Amazon. But I'm literally so excited, you guys. I'm so excited. I've never done an unboxing before, so I'm not going to know the specs or anything like that. I bought this refurbished as well, you guys, because... I heard it's a lot cheaper to buy on Apple's refurbished website. Their products are literally as good as new and they replace a lot of the parts in the computer as well. Wow. Nothing else in the box, obviously. They come in this white box that just says MacBook Pro and then Apple certified refurbished at the bottom. I'm sorry. Hopefully you guys can see that. It's kind of heavy. So I'm having a hard time, but I want to open this. I guess, should I bring you guys in a little bit closer? Oh my gosh, I'm literally so excited. I've actually, this is like my first big purchase of a computer, so this is amazing. Like, I've never gotten to do this before. Also, um, if you guys like my little setup, there will be a video on how I did all this right here. Well, obviously, I just put it down, but I'm going to do it with you guys in plan, so look out for that video next week. All right, let's get into it. This is literally so exciting. They, they don't smell the box, but... Why did I spell box? Okay. Oh. This is beautiful. Um, oh my gosh. Wow. So this is the laptop. It is huge, first of all. And I'm definitely going to show you guys a comparison compared to my other one. But I'm going to take this plastic off and we're going to do the smell test because apparently MacBooks smell really good. Okay, let's try it. Wow. It smells like coffee. Oh my gosh, why does it smell? Oops, I got a little smudge on there for my nose highlight. <laughs> why does it smell like coffee? But um, anyways, this is the MacBook. It's the Space Gray. It's beautiful, first of all. It looks amazing and wow. I'm holding it like backwards. I'm showing it to y'all like this. I feel like an idiot because guess what? It's supposed to go like this. <laughs> wow, this is this is beautiful. It's huge, first of all, and it's so heavy. Oh my gosh. Okay, but anyways, so inside it has the little USB-C. I'm actually really excited because these actually come with space gray stickers, which are literally so cute to me. And honestly, it's really cool that they're starting to do the stickers according to the color of what device you get. That's pretty amazing, but everything else I'm honestly not going to look at. I'm going to put this right back in here. Then, of course, we get the main charger right here. Paper. Usually, it's plastic. So, I'm just going to put this back on here because I won't be needing this box right now. This whole process is just super exciting to me, set up and all of that. But this is the laptop, and I kind of want to give you guys a quick little 
size comparison. This one is the 16 inch. I kind of want to get more specific on the specs. I ordered the refurbished 16 inch MacBook Pro 2.6 gigahertz, 6 core Intel with the i7. There's also like an i9. This one has 512 gigabytes and I also ordered the Pro app bundle for education because it comes with Final Cut Pro, Motion, a couple other apps for only like $1.99 and that's pretty much a good deal when it comes to getting Final Cut Pro because Final Cut Pro is usually like $300 which is kind of expensive but there's ways you can get it free but I didn't want to do that this time. This time? Basically just got the base model so I didn't really spec up anything you know I kind of just stuck with what it regularly came with because I didn't want to spend too much money and like I said I feel like anything would be an upgrade from my 13 inch MacBook Pro so I was like no need as you can see my dented Mac that has to light up oh my gosh I didn't even notice but this part lights up the Apple lights up ah that's cute okay and then this one doesn't it's just regular but that's the size comparison you guys literally this one's huge but I'm so excited to edit and watch movies and YouTube videos on it I just feel like that's gonna be just amazing amazing I'm gonna go ahead and set it up it probably needs to be charged but you know we're gonna have to set it up this is definitely so different though you guys because it comes with touch bar which obviously my laptop does not have touch bar so oh my gosh it's just it's so beautiful so setting my account up this process is always like the lengthy process of everything but i want to get everything done today because it, it literally needed to be done like it's it couldn't have been done any other day so i just set up my laptop partially um i did two different uh desktops because usually on my 13 inch macbook pro i usually have like at least four desktops to kind of go through and whatnot but the ones that i have up currently is this little night one and then i have this one that's also night because it's like a blue themed and i love the color blue and i just like the way the night looks but anyways that's kind of like my setup process I wasn't gonna get into depth with this setup but i did want to go ahead and unbox some of this tech that i have from amazon got a box full of stuff from amazon you know amazon has like the best tech in my opinion so anyways i have this passport drive here it's like a black passport drive. i have one of these already but Mine is literally like no space whatsoever. I like this brand of passports. I think it's pretty reliable. I have a two terabyte one, so I just got another one. I also got this little, what is it called specifically? So a multi-port USB-C hub because of course the new laptop doesn't come with any ports whatsoever. I don't use disks, so I'm not gonna get a disk drive unless I really, really need one, but I got this one in space gray what that looks like and it has a bunch of little ports in it which is literally needed um let me make sure it fits though and then i got this which is supposed to be like a lap a laptop stand because when i'm sitting on my bed i don't want to kind of put my laptop flat like that can cause overheating so it's just this silver or yeah it's a silver one i'll probably talk more about this when i actually use it and then i got a mouse which probably seems like stupid to get did they send me the wrong one I did not ask for a black mouse. I asked for a white one. Okay, no. So, you're probably like, why do you need a mouse? Which, I really don't need one, but I wanted to have one just in case. I feel so dumb because I did an outro, right? And that's already, uh, that's past tense. I already made it. But I didn't even put the laptop case on it. I know how unsatisfying that can be to some people. But I need to do this. So, let me just show you guys real quick. Okay. And then the top should just snap on, but it's plastic on it, so I'll take it off. I don't know if I have this on right. I mean... Pepsi, stop it, stop it. This is what she does, you guys, she abuses me. But anyways, um, everything is now set up. It's beautiful, first of all. The laptop case is really, really smooth. It's on there swiftly, and then of course we have a little pad here i'm literally so excited to use this you guys so without further ado that's gonna be in this video of course i already have an outro so you guys are gonna be seeing the next clip as an outro but you guys you guys enjoy and yeah let's move to the outro hey right, guys so that's in this video honestly i'm so excited to look more on my laptop i hope this video was okay like i said i'm not a huge tech person so don't go roasting me in the comments saying you said this wrong you did this wrong I probably did, but guess what? I'm a fashion channel. Read the room. That's about it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. I kind of wanted to do this video just to help people who are going back to school, kind of give you guys my first impressions. I'm literally so excited to use this. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. Definitely hit that subscribe button if you want to see more of me. But yeah, thanks for watching. Bye.